Well, as you can see, there's no bus driver in the cab, so that means the bus cannot drive. Uh, wait a minute, there was something on the news recently about driverless buses? Driverless buses? What do you mean? What do you mean? I'm the driver. I'm the bus driver. No one can replace me. Hey? Dear me, what is going on? Driverless buses? Hello, everybody. Anyone on the bus? Buses might be going autonomous soon. Did you hear that? Hey? Yeah, that's right. Buses might be going autonomous. What's, does that mean I'm out of a job? Not exactly, Anton. You won't be out of a job just yet. It's nice to relax in this green area. As you can see, here I am somewhere in South London on my bus. And uh, it's nice to be able to relax. Obviously, this route I'm driving. Uh, I can't tell you which route it is. But I won't be able to be driving, I won't be able to drive this route in a few months time because it's changing company. And I really like driving this route and it's sad that it's going. Um, but there will be routes coming to our company and there'll be routes going. It happens in a lot of companies around London. Buses keep moving depot every five or so years, you know. But anyway, um, speaking of buses, autonomous buses, that means, uh, well, bus drivers might not be needed in the future. Now there's something called, I think it's a Navia. Is it a Navia? N-A-V-Y-A. I think a Navia bus trial in East London around the Olympic Park. And these buses are very small. Um, and I think they're going to be trialling them, obviously now in September. It's already happening. Uh, but they only go two miles an hour. <laughs> two miles an hour? Who's going to get on one of them, eh? Well, you'll be surprised. Um, they're disabled. Less able. You know? Uh, end of the day, people will be able to get on a bus that goes two miles per hour. And I think it goes four bus stops. Four bus stops at two miles an hour. Um, does, it, does it take does the whole journey 12 minutes long? I don't know exactly how long the whole journey is. I think it was 12 minutes, it said. Um... But this is quite shocking. It is very shocking. I know also in Reno, Nevada. Yes, Reno in Nevada, which is in the United States of America. Um, they're actually trialling buses there now. Big buses. That's right. And I think they've got to go through, I think, is it three phases of trialling. And by, I think, early 2019. 2019, yes. 2019, they want to have... Autonomous buses. It's 2017. In fact, it's nearly the end of 2017. What? That gives us like, what? Not even two years left? What? 16 months? What? Oh, dear me. Oh, I don't want to go to the job centre to get another job. Please, please. Just let me be a bus driver, please. Oh, dear me. Is this the beginning of the end? Is it? Autonomous vehicles, autonomous buses. Autonomous trucks, autonomous vans, delivery vans, HGV, you name it. Cars, everything's going to be autonomous. Deary me. I mean, all right, at the moment, two miles an hour isn't fast, as you can see. I'm walking it. Two miles an hour, that's right. Two miles an hour is not exactly very fast. Yeah, look, I'm walking faster than two miles an hour. You see? Look at that. That's how fast the bus is going to go. No, it's going to go about this speed. This is two miles an hour. Ooh, are we there yet? Are we there? Oh, man. Seriously, I thought I would be driving till I'm, well, if I don't change my career, but I thought I'd be driving till I'm maybe 68, 70 years old, the way the pensions are going. It's probably going to be 75 years old, isn't it? We'll probably all die of heart attacks or something like that. All right then, so what are my options? Okay, I can drive till I'm uh, 70, 75 years old, but trust, trust me, um, autonomous buses will be will be there will be there very soon so that's 30 years away is it 38 and a half 68 so yeah I've got 30 to 35 years of bus driving left no there's no chance autonomous vehicles will be here before then oh dear me ah, don't be depressed Alan. don't worry everything's gonna be all right trust me there's always gonna be opportunities in life to do other things surely jobs crop up every all over the place. I mean, this YouTube channel.
you know, if I keep doing it for a few more years, I suppose it'll pay for some of the bills. You know what I mean? But it's not that. I like driving a bus. I like being in a bus. You know, I used to love sitting here on the front seat, overlooking everywhere. 12 foot high as a kid. King of the road, I used to say. King of the road, I used to say. Sat here. Upstairs above the driver. Obviously, there's no uh, things to look down. You could see the driver through that little glass, you know, thing image that you could see. Um, but I'm going to miss bus driving whenever that does stop. Yeah, driverless buses. That's going to be quite scary. Very, very scary. Mm. Hey, bus driver. I've heard you're going to be out of a job soon. Is that right? Hey, bus driver. <laughs> I'm out of a job. <laughs> not, not just yet. You'll be all right, Anton. Hang in there. You'll be all right. You'll have another ten or fifteen years. Obviously, these trials in Reno, Nevada, USA, and uh, trials in East London already. I've got quite a few more years left in me. But autonomous vehicles, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, are going to be here to stay. Yes, that's right. You've also got them Tesla cars that uh, the technology in Tesla cars, whew, I tell you, they're going to be autonomous very, very soon. They're already closing the doors by themselves. But until proven tests and trials finally, you know, make sure that they're going to be safe to be on the road, then obviously um, buses are going to be here to stay with the driver in the cab. That's right, driver. You're going to have your job for a few more years. Don't worry about it. You got my back. <laughs> oh, well. The future. It should be bright, hopefully. There'll be jobs somewhere. Anyway, everyone, have a lovely day. Don't let this get you down. Autonomous vehicles will come. Come very shortly. Oh, dear me. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm only acting. I've still got my job for a few more years, but um, it's really scary that trials are underway right now in East London and Reno, Nevada, United States. 2019 could have these big buses like this, like these. These buses will. These buses will be trialing. These buses. Probably five to ten years, these big London buses could be autonomous. Oh, I will, I will. I'm not going to worry about it. Nope, that's right. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, have a lovely day. Please like and share this video and subscribe to Double Decker Anton, and I'll see you all on the next video. Have a lovely day. Have a lovely day.